This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? You have come from the Jedi Council. Master Matali wishes to speak with you. I will inform him that you are here. Remain at this location until he arrives. My protocol droid tells me you are here on behalf of the Council. I was beginning to think my demands had been ignored. Though I think your time would be better spent interrogating the Sandals as to the whereabouts of my son Shen. Many years ago, I brought my family here to Dantooine to escape the crush of humanity on the core world. Soon after we settled here, the Sandrils arrived, and they have been a plague upon my house ever since. The injustices the Sandrils have committed against the Matales are far too numerous to name. But the Council is well aware of our many disputes. Recently I discovered several Sandril droids trespassing on my land. I have no idea what nefarious purpose lay behind their arrival. My own assassination, perhaps? Destruction of my property? Maybe a simple spy mission? I wasn't about to find out. My own security droids destroyed the invaders. Not a single one survived. At least you're efficient. It was shortly after this incident that Shen, my only son and heir to the Metali estate, vanished. Obviously, Nurik, the unscrupulous head of the Sandral clan, has abducted my son in retaliation for the destruction of his droids. Follow their stink south of here and you shall find them. I demand action on this matter, Jedi. Why does the Council insist on stalling? The life of my son is at stake. Is it possible... Yes, of course. Now I understand. I am a man of the world, Jedi. I know how things are done. I will make a contribution of a thousand credits to the Council in exchange for rescuing Shen from the Sandrils. I will present the credits directly to you, of course. Whether the Council ever learns of this donation is completely up to you. Two thousand. Your greed is outstripped only by your utter lack of any sense of proportion, Jedi. Two thousand. Even if you would pay such a fee, what could you possibly need so many credits for? For that price, I could purchase enough droids to destroy the entire Sandral estate. Two thousand is out of the question. Nevertheless, my offer still stands. A thousand credits for Shen's safe return. Know, however, that I will not sit idly by much longer. Eventually. I will take whatever action is necessary to rescue my son, including raising the entire Sandral estate. Until you find Shen, Jedi, we have nothing further to discuss. I suggest you hurry south to their estate, lest I take matters into my own hands. Ah! <laughs> 
What can I do? Yes?
I said, I am C842, a personal assistance droid. Although in recent months the assistance I render seems to have taken on a disproportionate significance. Did she send you to find me? Please do not tell her you saw me. No, I ran away of my own free will. But I have my reasons. I'm afraid my owner became a bit too attached to me. Obsessed, even. She... she tried to treat me as her dead husband. It was not healthy for her. She is obsessed. She rarely sees other people and appears to be fixated on me as her husband. She was becoming more and more insular. I thought it best that I leave. She may meet other real people this way. In fact, that was the reason I came here and sought out those cat hounds. I think it would be best if I were no longer a factor. She would meet new people, living people, please. Will you destroy me? What? No! You'd make her suffer like that? You monster! <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. 